Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. I'm here to introduce you to my little fur babies. That's Kibbles. Kibbles. Say hi Papa. That's Kibbles and his nickname is Papa. Okay. We have adopted him from the shelter in Manhattan, New York. And we adopted him when he was about a year old. Um, we didn't know much about him for the fact that the only thing they knew was that he was sad. And they had on his paperwork that the owner had dropped him off. That he refused, he refused to play with toys and he didn't want to eat and all this stuff. But for some reason, my husband picked him out. Um, we got him, we actually picked him out October 24th, and October 27th was the day that he came home, so his birthday is October 27th, and he was supposed to be my birthday gift, since my birthday is October 2nd, and he, I consider him as a Halloween baby, because it was a few days before Halloween. And these are my other two babies. Honey. Hi, honey. That's Honey Baby. Honey Baby. And that's Foxy Mama. Okay. These two came from a friend of ours. May God rest her soul that she had passed away a few years ago. Um, her boyfriend had given these two little girls two her but she, they ended up being allergic to it for the fact that um they are long hair chihuahuas but as you see <laughs> they got a haircut um so let's talk about honey honey and foxy actually let's talk about both of them right about now honey and foxy um were passed down on their records they say they were passed down about five times we are not sure why, but um, my husband also picked them out because the girl had called him and let him know that we they were able to keep them. So, he rushed over to them. It was about 12 o'clock at night, and um, they came. <laughs> Foxy! They came home in a duffel bag. And I'm calling him and I'm calling him. And he comes through the door with this red duffel bag. And these two little guys popped out. Or these two little girls popped out. So let me talk to you about Foxy. Foxy Mama is the mother of Honey Baby. Okay. Foxy was born April 1st. And she is 14 years old. Um, she was very sassy, very tough, and, I mean, she was snap. I'm telling you, she is, but now at the age of 14, she is about 95% blind. That's why she made those faces earlier, because she's trying to figure out what I'm doing. Um, other than that, there's nothing really wrong with her, except that she's very slow because of her blindness. We live in a small mini apartment. Or studio apartment and she knows her way around foxy foxy hi foxy okay and this is honey honey is also very sassy she took over her attitude um honey took over foxy's attitude now fox honey i'm sorry now honey she is very sassy, very tough, and she loves to dance. Like, she'll want your attention, and she does this dancing movement, and she'll spin for you, especially when you give her a certain treat. So, Honey Baby. Honey Baby was born February 18, and she is 13 years old. She's the mama. She's the baby, okay? Supposedly, they were brought together and throughout their paperwork, you see both of the names together. So, their whole lives, they've been together. So, Foxy is 
an April Fool's baby. And Honey is a Valentine's Day baby. So, we got them. And they've been a blessing ever since. And it's, what's funny is, is that they came a month later after we got Kibbles. Okay? Oh, by the way, Kibbles is supposed to be a Situ mix. And, um... We don't know what he's mixed with, but I'm guessing he he looks more like an Apostle Aso. Okay? Kibbles came from the shelter. Okay? And that is my best birthday gift ever. He is so funny, and he follows me everywhere I go, and he gives kisses. And then these guys, okay, they came to us at 8 and 9 years old. As you can see, Honey is very shy. Oh, she don't know what I'm doing, but Foxy and Honey, the best blessing ever. They came to us November 25th. And they are our Thanksgiving babies. Okay? They're also Thanksgiving babies because they came a few days before Thanksgiving. Guys, I'm doing this video for the fact that don't be afraid to go to the shelter and look around. We've looked around two different shelters. Um, one shelter had like big dogs and we were really into the big dogs like that. Um, I really wanted a smaller dog that fit in my pocketbook, but unfortunately, these guys, these two don't fit in a pocketbook, as you can see. They are considered long-haired chihuahuas. Um, well, they're not long anymore, because this weekend, we had just gave them a haircut, all three of them. And, um, yeah, yeah, they came to us at 8 and 9. We had all three of them for about five years. And like I was saying, don't be afraid to adopt and look around. These dogs, if they were in the shelter, they would have died in the shelter for the fact that they're blind. One is blind, which is Foxy. And they would have been separated, you know. They came together. They grew up together. Supposedly their mother and daughter. And I think if they were was separated. I think they would have died without each other. And as you can tell. They're always together. They sleep together. Um, and they're very spoiled. You know. At first. I never owned a dog before. And I was like. Oh my god. What am I going to do with three dogs. But it's the best thing ever. I mean you guys. Got three kids, four kids, five kids. I have one myself. Um, it's the same thing as taking care of your children. These are children. <laughs> they're fur babies. Okay? And they're very spoiled. But like I said, don't be afraid to go and look and adopt. Instead of paying hundreds and hundreds of dollars for a dog. These dogs can be your best friend. Okay, so I just wanted to introduce you to them. And those are my babies. And we have a little picture of Kibbles up there. And that's originally what Kibbles is supposed to look like. But his hair grows curly and it's very hard to maintain. So we just decide to shave him all off and do the poofy feathered tails on all three of them. And what is a miracle that my husband says... That they all came the same color and they were meant to be together. So, they are my babies. Alright guys, so I wanted to introduce you to them. Hun Kibbles, that's his favorite chair. Kibbles, Honey, and Little Foxy. Okay. So, and Chihuahuas are the best. They're smart. They're very smart, guys. I mean, all dogs are smart, but these guys are so smart. All right, guys. I've talked enough about them. These are my little babies. So, go out and go look into the shelters because they got many little dogs that need homes. 
especially the elderly dogs. And I know a lot of people don't like to adopt elderly dogs. But they don't know any better but the shelter. And please adopt if you can. And, um, yeah, that will end up being your best friend. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. God bless. And have a nice day. And see you next time.